Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. To manage devices in Windows 11, open the Settings app window and then click the Bluetooth and Devices button at the left side of the screen. Then either click the View More Devices link at the right side of the window or click the Devices setting button to show the devices connected to your Windows 11 computer at the right side of the window grouped by category and appearing below the Bluetooth setting. To remove a connected device, click the More Options button at the right end of the device's name in the listing of devices. Then select the Remove Device command from the pop-up menu that appears. To enable Swift Pair for supported Bluetooth devices in Windows 11, ensure the Show Notifications to Connect Using Swift Pair Toggle Switch is set to the On position. To download device software over metered connections in Windows 11 if desired, click the Download Over Metered Connections toggle switch to set it to the on position. However, if this setting is enabled, note that data charges and data usage may apply depending on your data usage plan. There are also related settings for devices in Windows 11 that appear under the Related Settings section. Clicking the Sound Setting button shows the sound settings, and clicking the Display Setting button shows the display settings, which were both discussed in the previous chapter. If you open either of these settings from this window, then click the Back button in the upper left corner of the Settings app window to return to the Devices settings. To open a wizard in Windows 11 that lets you send or receive files using Bluetooth with other discoverable devices that have Bluetooth enabled, Click the Send or Receive Files via Bluetooth setting button to open the Bluetooth File Transfer Wizard. Then follow the steps in the wizard and click the Next button in each screen to send or receive the files. To open the Devices and Printers dialog box in Windows 11, click the Devices and Printers setting button. In the Devices and Printers dialog box, you can click the Add a Device, or add a printer link to open the Add a Device dialog box, which you can also use to connect devices. For example, to add a shared network printer in Windows 11, you may need to click the The Printer That I Want Isn't Listed link in the Add a Device dialog box that appears after clicking the Add a Printer link to show the Add Printer wizard. The Add Printer wizard provides additional options for connecting older printers, connecting shared printers, connecting printers by IP or host name, and manually adding network printers. Simply select the desired options in the Add Printer Wizard and click the Next button until you finish adding the printer. Also note you can access this same wizard within the Printers and Scanners settings in Windows 11, which we will discuss in the next lesson. To close the Devices and Printers dialog box, click the X button in its upper right corner. To close the Settings app window when finished, click the X button in its upper right corner. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.